Welcome back to Factorio, folks. We are joined, as always, by ST Hedgehog. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. And what are you up to? Uh, nuclear. Nuclear. I'm with nuclear power. Mm -hmm. um, because there's a problem. And I think it was pointed out to me, and I might have over... Uh, just over... Overlooked it. Uh, looked it, yeah, essentially. My train just run out of fuel, just as it's pulled into the, the parking. Awesome. Uh, as you can see right here, with this inserter right here, uh, I had it all set so that the centrifuges outload uh, output onto the belt, and then afterwards the belt filters the light uranium and dark uranium. Mm -hmm. The drawback to that is that because there's so much more light uranium, it fills the whole belt up, which means there's no space to put any of the dark uranium on the belt. So... Yeah, the whole thing just basically falls apart and stops working. So, um, so yeah, I, I'm going to clear this all out and uh, rebuild it with something a little bit different. Okay, sounds interesting. Because I can, because I hopefully I, I, I have I have something else in mind that's going to use logic. Okay. And, I forgot uh, to put Cool, cool. And I have got our two uh, copper pickups going here. And I forgot to put a... Radar down, down here. But now we can see what's going on. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And then, of course, I have all the miners down down here, but uh, I don't have them hooked up yet. And I think I'll wait to do that because we are running low on power, as mentioned. Yes, yes, yes. We have a, a, uh, a nuclear uh, problem. Yeah. And we are actually running low on iron. Uh, we, we don't have enough iron ore coming in. Ah. We should be good for nuclear power now, though, because I've manually fed that thing, so it should be able to create... Because uh, it creates 10 fuel cells. Mm -hmm. So we should be good for it for a while. Okay. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully. Let's well. uh, clear all this out down here. What I'm thinking of doing is going and getting some more miners and clear out this whole area of biters and then hook up that 165 million iron ore patch. I think that would probably be good. Um, don't have a whole lot of rockets, so... I'll go pick up some rockets, I'll go pick up some miners, and then we'll go do that. We'll go here and here. Let's just dump it in here, can't we? So if I guess a filter insert, sir. Which I don't have. I have a stack filter in circle because I need some of those for the uh, for the next build. As well. Oh, oh that means, yeah. we have a lot of copper now, so that's nice. There are actually one, two, what six trains full of copper ore just sitting waiting to go to a, a stop uh, to to drop it off. Mm. Might want some more copper plate trains actually, but no, because they are sitting there with destination faults. So this isn't a hundred percent working yet, but it's fine, it's fine. What is that? Oh, that's... Oh. And my inventory 
is full of uranium. That sounds unhealthy. Ah, it's good for the bones. Ah, okay. So I've been told. <laughs> I've never heard that. It was the same people that thought that lead was good to put in petrol. Ah! Those brainiacs. Yeah. Lead is good for petrol, asbestos was good for roofs. Mm hmm. You know, those, those, those bunch of people. Yeah. Carrying uranium around in your pockets is good for the bones. So. Okie dokie. Where's our stone looking? Looks like we have plenty. Okay. Are we there yet? Nope, not yet. Almost. Where about to go? Fly, my pretties. I need more robots. Yeah, they are nice to have. Uh, although I only have two uh, robot ports, so 50 robots is my max. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else I want to get rid of? I don't think so. Oh, material is full. No. Wow, yeah. get, get up there. Um, where is the mold drone? Don't go up there. You need to come over here. I'll go there. I like how Spidertron's legs sit there tip tapping when, when it's on a belt. Yes. Yeah. I would stand still, but I can't. Nope. <laughs> Okay, that's enough space for the minute. There we go. So, uh, so this is going to be the confusing part. So I need all the. Uh, I need all of it to be on on one side and then I need the 235 to be on the other side. There we go. What do I am gonna have there? Okay, there we here. Go. Over okay. here. So so I'm actually copying a build from uh Nilaus. 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 I don't really want, I want. This is where the uh, other, other inserters come in. So we're going to have a stack inserter there, a filter stack inserter there, a stack inserter here, like this. Oh, I should have and we want grabbed some this priority as over well. this belt here. We don't want this belt coming. We just want it to top up the belt after this comes out. So we don't want to add more to this. So, die, oh, die, die, die. Is very uh, friendly sound in if the biters wouldn't bite, then I wouldn't kill them. 
Ah, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Fair enough. So you're going to take out 235, and you're going to take out 238. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. And then I'm going to go Good skis. And you're going to have to die too. Let's copy his build completely before I mess it up. Okay. That's great, okay, it's, it's not the same thing. So they're dead, then we'll kill these guys down on the uranium. Just literally uh, back away out there, but this one's to have priority to the right. So the rest will force them. Okay. 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 Now, now we get confusing here because we need to use combiners and 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 things, and stuff and things in OD. So okay, that sounds exciting. A, uh, a decided combiner and an arithmetic combiner. Mm-hmm. Well. Well, disconnect now. I don't have that many rockets left. That's not good. Uh, there is a train with uh, a couple of hundred on. Yeah, uh, uh, but uh, I have. Uh, I think. No. You okay. have lasers. I do. That is true. I just picked up a bunch of rockets. Where the heck are they? Did I already put them in? I guess I did. So, 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 um, oh, I've never built a counter factory before, although I do understand the concept of this. So, we want to go from the stack inserter to the decider, and then from the decider to itself. And the decider wants to be uh, uranium 235. Okay. Good. Um, yes, yes, it wants to be set to. Oh. What's that done? Okay. So let's just make sure there aren't any here in the Okay. So all of that is cleared. Ah, your energy level is greater than zero. Okay, so this this is this is new to me. This is new to me. Yes, I am following the tutorial as we're playing right here. <laughs> how it works. Uh because I don't understand how um how, how things work. So we don't want to enable that. We want to read hand contents. We want to pulse it. So so every time this picks something up, it will pulse the decider and the decider will count. And it will start counting uranium-235 and it will output uranium-235 and it will, it will count up. So you then want to have this set to enable and only enable if the uranium is
Good job. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, 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 I watched it once already, and and the numbers, the numbers, the numbers. There are so many numbers, and I'm confused. That's not counting up, and that's absolutely fine. Okay. Most of the trees are gone now. Okay, we are clearing. We're going to have to clear all these. Cliffs as well. A lot of damn cliffs. The, the annoying thing is that this 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 uh this this little tutorial I'm following here has has a blueprint in the description of the YouTube video, but it's not the thing he actually builds in the YouTube video. So yeah. Uh... Yeah, that is a little bit annoying. I'm sure, I'm sure it was that you only enable it if the count is less than 40. I'm sure that's what it was. So if the count is less than 40, and it's only enabled if the count is less than 40. So it'll pick up 40, and once it picks up 40, it will turn itself off. Then, you use the other side, where it's outputting the items. You connect it to a arithmetic combiner. And connect the arithmetic combiner to the uh, output of the decider. And you tell this to take uranium 238 and uh, times it by minus 20. Which sounds weird. But this always takes in two. Um, always, It always picks up two in one, in one go. So when it picks up two, it then triggers, and two times minus 20 is minus 40. And the 40 minus 40 is zero, so that means it turns on the first incessor. Make sense? Make, uh, right. Good. Not, kinda. Kinda. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Kinda, kind, uh, no. <laughs> kinda, uh, no. Okay. And then what we want to do up here is we actually want two. Um, this is a gigantic ore patch, man. Okay. I need right, an input there, then we need a belt coming down here, but we need a filter, or oh, I'm going to go with a stack filter insert, so let's build some more stack filter insert. Um, there, it's only picking uh, uh, There are stack filter inserters in the uh, mall train, I think. The output left only that one. Okay, I, I've been I've been making my own there. Not I, I need a few, so I've not really. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Been too worried about it for the minute, but but that can come down here. You, uh, I don't know why I'm using. But I should just use stop. Just use blue belts. It's because I've got red belts on me. That's the problem. But get rid of the red belts. Shoot, shoot red belts. Just use the blue ones. There. We go. Okay, and then what we want to do is we want to have a. Um, Let's jump out of this. Put that there. Uh, and again, we could use another another spitzer for this. Okay. 
from a rain cliff. Because it's important that this gets added after this one. So this this stack inserter gets priority on the belt before this one does. Because otherwise the whole system falls apart and explodes. And, and, uh, explodes? Crying and, and it's, it's, it's bad. It's really bad. Yeah, it's terrible. It's terrible. You don't you don't you don't, you don't want to. No, that, you don't want exploding belts. No, no, that that doesn't sound good. Right, and then what we should be able to do here, hopefully, provided we've got this right, is stick some product put up there, productivity modules in here, um, which don't throw the system out because this is outputting, outputting that way. <laughs> Turn that round so it's outputting, uh, is outputting onto here, and only forty can go by. And get put back in the machine. So there's going to be like three or four on a belt that is wasted, but that's better than the 41 plus 90 that I had in the machine last time uh, that was wasted. Yeah. Hopefully, that's the theory. Okay, that'll do, and then... Um, yeah, and I dump 40 in this, boom, and it stops running. And... Then we watch in awe to find out if it works before I copy and paste it all and, and get it all terribly wrong. <laughs> But the thing with this build is that once I've seeded it with 40 uranium 235, it should never need any more ever added to it. That is pretty cool. So, that is all good. Uh, I am very confused about how this has got on this one here. I think this is wrong, isn't it? This needs to be output right on the uranium 235. And put it in there. Put it in there. That work? Did, 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 it, did it work? Put yes, it yes, yes, it did. It did. It produced one extra. Which went back in the machine. And it reset. Oh, cool. I think. So that stopped that one there. So I've got to leave this running for a little bit just to check it does work. Uh, and in the meantime, we can empty all this out here because this is no longer required. Way, way over complicated build. Mainly because I wasn't quite sure what I was doing and I was looking for something that didn't use logic because I wasn't confident in logic back then. Well, still not now, but hey ho. It'll be fine. Let's just uh, let's just let's just walk over here. Let's let our robots do the thing here, okay, and then we'll just use the map to uh, see whether this works. And all the time, hopefully, our nuclear power is still holding up. It is. It is. It's doing the trick. Back to go. This can go. One out. Okay, something went wrong. Oh, yes, of course I know. Uh, I, I put it directly in the machine, didn't I? Okay, yeah. That can go, that can go. Okay. Why do I drop my spider tron? Uh, oh, there he is. I need those. I need one of those as well.
Okay, so now I can copy this and I can put it in here. Uh, oh, oh, I didn't actually set the output to the, uh, the arithmetic combiner. So it hasn't taken 40 away from anything. It's, it's just these done nothing. That's why. That's why. There we go. There we go. Now, hopefully, hopefully, You're missing one item. That's interesting. Oh, is that because that was all 41? I think it was because it was all 41. Yeah. Okay. 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 There we go. And up here, I actually need to put that thing. Okay. So that, that, uh, that belts again. With that coffee, with that coffee in my guts up there. Um, so that inserter picks up, and every time it picks up, it tells this decider combiner to count. The decider counts to 40, and if the count is less than 40, or if the count is 40 or more, it, it turns off the inserter, so it no longer puts any goods in the, in the centrifuge. Then when the centrifuge finishes things, it outputs the stacking filter, which does two mo two uh, two motions. Two motions is two ticks. Two times minus twenty is minus forty. You take that away from the decider, which drops the decider down to forty again, or from forty down to zero, which turns on the inserter, which allows stuff to go in, and then the whole thing rinses and repeats. If you say so. That is that is what I say so. That is also what uh, Nilaus say so say, says. However you pronounce his name, mm, Nilaus. Nilaus. Okay, uh, Nilaus is my. Um, yeah, so so he, he's Danish, uh, and he pronounces oh. it Nilaus. Okay, so then yeah, yeah. Right, well, uh, I'm not Danish, so I pronounce it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, that's 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 uh... Uh, my, my prerogative uh, it is to pronounce his name wrong yeah, let's just copy on this in oh man so much beautiful uranium Okay. Okay. And that is working. And that is repeating. And that is making all the stuff. And then I have to do is copy and paste it many, many times. Ooh. Then we will be back in business. And that's our nuclear power fixed. Hopefully. Fantastic. So, uh, yeah, I will copy and paste this and uh, get it all running between episodes because I need to manually feed it so much stuff to uh, start it running because uh, we, we are actually out of time. Again? It yeah, keeps happening. we are. It we does are. keep happening. Yeah. Well, I have nowhere near enough miners. Okay. 
Well, I need to go back and get belts and stuff anyway, so it's fine. It's fine. Six. We'll go with six. We'll go with six. Six is good. All right, shall we call it then? Yes. Yes, let's, let's uh, leave it here. Yeah. Um, do you know what? No, we're going to go with ten. We're not going to go with six. We're going to go with ten, which is probably overkill. Seven, eight, nine, ten. But ten is a good number. Yeah. All right. So, uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have fun.